I've got three children. I'm divorced, so I don't have my kids all of the time. But anytime that I don't have my kids, I start the day by I send them a daily dad thought. I just send them a text. That, bro. Yeah, and, and the one I sent them this morning is one of my all-time favorite quotes that I, I learned probably when I was around their age. And that is, if you do the things others don't do, you'll have the things others don't have. Mm. But I actually like to change the word a little bit to, if you do the things others won't do, you'll have the things others won't have. If you're not getting the result that you want, then you need to make sure that you're putting the right inputs in. It just depends on your definition of consistency. See, most people, I believe it's time plus consistency will get us almost anything in this world that we want. But that's subjective because some people are like, hey, I've been on a diet for three days and I haven't lost any weight. I've been consistent for three days. And you're yeah. like, well, yeah, you realize this could potentially take three weeks, three months, maybe three years to get where you're trying to go. You know, no one goes out and shoots hoops for three days and is a world class shooter. You got to do that every single day. And it's the same thing. If you're smiling and dialing 10 calls every single day, well, yeah, anyone can do that for a week. Yeah. Yeah. Some people can do it for a month. Very few people can do that for a year. Almost no one can do that for a career. Whether it's inner peace, it's a fulfilling relationship, whatever it may be, financial freedom. The only way you'll have those things is by doing what most people aren't willing to do. And what most people aren't willing to do is focus on the fundamentals for long periods of time consistently. See, don't make the mistake of leading and selling and making decisions based on your mood based on how you feel in the moment. See, as human beings, we have a constant roller coaster and ebb and flow of feelings and emotions. And that's okay, that's part of the human experience. But if you make decisions and you lead and you sell based on how you feel in the moment, by very definition, you become inconsistent. And when it comes to selling and when it comes to leading and when it comes to growing your business, consistency matters. And if I had an opportunity to meet each and every one of you individually, I could say this to every single person in the room. Your team can't become something you're not. You can't lead your team somewhere you're not going yourself.